Super excited to share our latest project with you today, MIDI Seek, an eight track 64 step sequencer with eight parameter lanes for each track, each with their own clock divider, direction and last step settings. Yeah, that's 72 clock dividers, as well as per step micro timing, ratchets with velocity, time ramping, trig conditions, parameter conditions, note length support, slides, and plenty more. Nearly forgot the headline features, parameter locks and automation. Finally, native in Ableton, um, and you have full control over how that behaves. It can either hold until the next trig or um, be updated on the next step. They've been implemented using the modulation feature in live. So you have full control of the parameter still in Ableton and you can just modulate up or down from that point. Yeah, we've gone pretty deep on this one, inspired by the, the greatest step sequences, old and new. We're here to bring XOX hardware workflow to your door today. Honestly, there's too many features for us to outline in this short video, um, but a couple of our favorites are trigger input step sequencing mode, inspired by the infamous Roland SH-101, as well as the comprehensive copy, paste, and reset circuit that can operate down to the single step or across the whole pattern. Um, and yeah, there's an experimental interpolation circuit in there too, so you can morph between any of the presets, um, Octatrack style. There's also a full MIDI note processing circuit with optional scale quantization. We have Western and exotic scales in there with pitch bend up to 48 semitones. So if you combine that with the per step parameter slides with individual control over the rise and fall times, you have some pretty sweet pitch glides which go beyond 303 territory. We've done our best to compress all this power of 30,000 plus parameters into the tiny real estate available in Ableton. So you've got dynamic UI, which should give you a good indication of what's happening in your pattern and where you are relative to live transport. Um, but don't take our word for it. We've got a quick highlight reel of some demos with some annotations pointing out the features. Um, there's also a metronome stress test in there because a fancy sequencer with all these features that can't keep time is useful to no one. If you're worried about the number of parameters and the fact some of them don't have labels, no stress. We've added detailed descriptions for each parameter in the info view of Ableton. So everything is right there where you need it. Um, we know it's 2025 and most of you hate manuals. Also, everything is MIDI and key mappable. We already have full bank support for push, but are looking into extending our support further. That's all for now. Eventually, we'll create some videos going on a deeper dive into some of the features. But um, if you don't want to hang around for that, and I recommend you don't, uh, head to our website, reclaimedbcn.com, or follow the link in the description and grab MIDI Seek today whilst our one-time intro offer is running. Um, we don't buy into any of that Black Friday, Cyber Monday nonsense. You're either an early adopter or you're not. So grab it for 30 euros today whilst you can. And yeah, needless to say, a lot of time, research and effort went into this. So we hope it was worth the grind. Anyway, um, we hope you enjoy playing with MIDI Seek. Excited to see what the world of electronic music producers and creative souls can do with it. Um, make sure to tag us on Instagram and we'll repost our favorites. In the meantime, here's some snippets of what it can do. All sounds in this video were sequenced by MIDI Seek. Except my voice, of course. That's mostly human. Is it?
Paris. All cars in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? Sleeky. All cars in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? All cars in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? Sleeky. All cars in this video were sequenced by me, of course. All cards in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? Sleeky. All cards in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? All cards in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? Sleeky. All cards in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? All cards in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? All cards in this video were sequenced by me, of course. Except me. Or is it? All cards in this video were sequenced by me.